We have to recognize that we have a, a true self and a, and a false self, our conditioned mind. A conditioned mind is who we learned to be. And that conditioned mind is, is, um, is a fear-based self, right? We have our protective mechanism, and that's our mind generally. It's a fear-based mechanism. It's always looking what's wrong or what could go wrong in any and all situations. Why? It's its job. That's its job. It's not a bad thing. You need something like that. But the problem is you have a conditioned mind that is fear-based. Its job is protection. It's like the bodyguard, right? What's the bodyguard going to look like? The bodyguard is going to walk into a room. Is it going to look for, oh, isn't that going to be fun? Oh, look how cute that is. Oh, that's very nice. Is that the bodyguard's job? No. The bodyguard goes in and looks in every corner if they're doing their job properly, right? Every corner of that room, who's here? What do they have underneath their coat? What could go wrong? What might go wrong? Hey, this is in the right place. I don't think that was there yesterday. We should check this out. What about the floor? You could slip on that. What about that? What about that? What about that? That's the bodyguard's job, right? It's doing what it's supposed to do. Here's the problem. The problem is we believe it all the time. The problem is we tend to run our life based on it, okay? Your bodyguard, your mind's job is not happiness. It's not to make you happy, I'm sorry. I wish it was, but it's not. It's to protect you, keep you alive, survival, that's it. And it's not, it, their job is not to make you successful. It's not, it doesn't care about success. Success and alive are very, very different, aren't they, okay? And so your bodyguard's job, your protective mind's job is not to make you successful and not to keep you happy, it's to keep you alive.